All right, restart of the game. So let's see how things go. Bad, Artanis. A lot of dead people down there. We gotta take these bastards out. What could have led these Terrans to come under Amon's thrall? They were assigned to some top secret details, running security at Doctor Narud's hybrid research labs. After Valerian re-established the government, the Mobius Foundation went dark. Last transmissions were chaotic, crazed. Next thing we know. The attack started. The Naaman has turned them into his slaves. An army. They are dangerous, but they are only the start of the war to come. You always were the optimistic sort. Huh. Alright, so the core. What new stuff do we got? Oh, we got the Nexus Overcharge. Spirit of Dune automatically harvest us. Yes, fuck yes! So glad we got that now. Okay. To the War Council. The War Council awaits you. Carax has utilized data from glaciers to bring the robotic sentinels online. The enemy Use their shall be to The shadow. The enemy shall be purified. Intercepts and attacks enemy ground units. Uh, nifty, but no. The Shadow Guard waits. Pretty much have a Dark Templar army. Tech speed and movement speed by fifty. Yeah, fifty percent. Yeah, for this one, I'm gonna stick with those. Our scout. So reporting Amon's forces are conquering system after system. Yes, yes. Mobius Corps is making their way to Bennett Port with the artifact. We gotta stop them before they get away with it. All right. Now the tough part about this mission is that you will be dealing with basically the Terrans best, because uh, they use battle cruisers, they use ravens, all that other good stuff. Another problem you're gonna run into is the fucking hybrid. Not necessarily the Ravagers and the... whatever those white ones are called, but the there's like another one that has Psy Storm, because Blizzard seems to have a fetish with that ability. This Kerrigan got it, Mar had it, and then these things have it. Those towers had it. Yeah, it's like they have a fetish for Psy Storm. Yeah, they'll fight alongside us, but once the little Psy thingy goes up... I, I find it a little obnoxious because once this little Psy Storm basically starts... I don't know what you would call it, actually, but it makes all the um, Terrans... Both good, both your allies and enemies. Basically, they just can't move or anything. It like it stuns them. And that's when the hybrid attack, and then after the stun ends, Moby sends a fuck ton of guys at your base. So it doesn't really give you the best. Uh, uh, how to put this? It doesn't give you the ideal opportune moments to strike here and there. I mean, it's doable. I'm not saying it's impossible. Or... At least what's left of it. Mobius cores entrenched themselves here to keep us from the artifact. Valerian's setting up his base now. Once he gets... Oh. Raynor, what is happening? The hybrid are channeling void energy into the Keystone. The resulting psionic disruption has overwhelmed the Terrans. Deploy our immortals. We need heavy assault to protect these Terrans until the disruption subsides. Man, that's two I owe you, Artanis. Felt like I was losing my damn mind. The Keystone is recharging, Commander. They will surely activate it again soon. We must reclaim it. You ain't kidding. Let's lock and load, partner. 
doesn't that go against the uh, plotline they established in Wings of Liberty, though? Because didn't Warfield say it operates at a, uh, what did he say, subsonic level or something like that? We can construct immortals from the robotics facility. They are quite effective at sieging enemies or defending our allies. All right, my boys are taking this fight to Mobius Corps. But once you've got your defenses in place, bring the heat. All right, let's pull you guys back. This disruption has hit my forces hard. We've taken heavy casualties, and we're going to need more time to establish our fortifications. Do what you can to keep them at bay. Already on it. Your position will be secure till they fire off that keystone again. Several of our Dominion research facilities are reporting that they are under attack. If you can rescue them, I'll return any Protoss technology they've collected to you. Sounds like a fair deal. Now let me put a pylon up here, because that's where I'm going to keep all my essential stuff. That way it's not in the front lines or anything like that. Let me cancel those last two. Another disruption will occur soon. Remember, we can use this time to protect our allies from the hybrid or attack Mobius Corps. Oh, I'll be able to liberate one of those thingy what's its We have liberated a Dominion facility. Oh, I can't believe we made it out alive. Some of our medics will stay behind in case you need them. All right, and then I believe they're headed for Rainer here. They come in waves of two. And annoyingly, the stun thing doesn't work on them either. Fall back, fall back. Back, back, back. It's nice. That gave me ample or er, ample resources to work with. Mobius Corps has turned their sights upon our Nexus. Prepare for battle. All will worship or be forever silent. Quack. Oh crap, run away you!
Uh, lucky little raven gets to get away. All right, let's go see if we can claim this. Oh, damn it. Come hither. You have not in I am but a phantom. Got to I avoid. I know. All right, I want to see if Valerian can actually survive for a minute. Although, yeah, since there's that second wave coming. It's grief they wiped them out. send an attack after me okay at least they rebuild their stuff that's good to know Cancel one of those. I walk the shadowed path. Send you up there. So I'm wondering if slapping a few towers will help out. The 
Keystone is about to emit another disruption nova. The Terrans will be incapacitated while the disruption is active. Never mind, they're headed for Valerian again. Establish a fortification line here. From the shadows, I am here. I walk the shadowed path. You require my skill. We are one with the shadows. I am the heart of the darkness. Alright, now to wait for the Mobius attack. If it's coming at all. You must construct additional pylons. Oh yeah, I forgot all about that yet. Oh, they cut me a break this time? How kind of them. Oh, nope. Well, certainly weaker than their than their normal. Back, back, back. The Keystone is emitting powerful energies. I expect it will fire again soon. Run away. For the reckoning, there are cool. 
Alright, let's let them go towards, uh... Rainer or whatever. Yeah, they got those fucking things. So far, so good, though. Very well. Thank heavens. Almost everyone died. Just a few medevacs left. I'll send them to support the Emperor's forces. Emperor Valerian, we have secured all of the threatened facilities. I promise you, I won't forget this kindness, Hierarch. Slice and dice. And I believe the pat yeah, the path of their main base is right there. <laughs> Unfortunately, they've been blocked off. while the disruption is active. Oh, crap. Okay, at least I staved off that first wave. Get back, get back.
Let's pull these guys back. Alright, fully healed. Get another immortal out here. We are one with the shadow. Stay I hope that was the attack meant for me. Actually, yeah, I'm 90% certain that that was the attack meant for me. Congratulations, you killed the cannon. Keystone is about to emit another disruption nova. The Terrans will be incapacitated while the disruption is active. Alright, that should keep both of those bases protected. You must place that in a power field. Please state the name Where's my immortal? Oh, he's right over there. Let fear consume you! Alright, so we're gonna get slowed down off the get go. All right, we win. Okay, that wasn't nearly as bad as I thought it was going to be.
Did you know this warrior? No. But I know his story. I know all their stories. None of them ever think it'll end like this. Reports been coming in from all over. Dominion worlds overrun. Outposts destroyed. A lot more dead boys out there. Warriors. Death is the fate of all warriors. A fate we too may soon embrace. Fate ain't ridden our tennis. Way I see it, if Zeratul believed you could make a difference in all this, then this fight's just begun. It is your custom to shake the hand of a friend, is it not? So yeah, that mission <laughs> took me by surprise at how easy it was, or wasn't. So I guess the trick is, if you can deal with that first wave of hybrid that come in, by the time the second ones come about, the um, between you know picking off what's left of their guys and all that stuff like that, second wave generally won't be able to do much damage, because as soon as they hit, the timer's like at less than 30 seconds. So all you really need to do is kill the first wave, and then... Maybe for the first couple of rounds, kill the second waves. But once those dudes with Scythe start popping up, oh, jeez. And even towards the end, you know, you saw it damage a shit ton of my guys. Between those uh, three guarding the Keystone. But yeah, ideally, attack whenever that Scythe Storm or whatever it's called hits. Because then the Terrans are a lot, e or Mobius is a lot easier, well, Terrans and Mobius. They're a lot easier to kill because they won't be able to fight back. And it saves you a lot of minerals and gas. I think that may have been the problem. Is that I was striking alongside my allies, which, you know, in retrospect, isn't a terrible idea. It's there's a there's logic to be had with that, but it is more it is better if you do it while everybody's stunned. Essentially it's you and the hybrid going blows going blow to blow with each other. And then as soon as that attack come, comes at you from uh whatchamacallit, the uh Mobius guys, because they send a shit ton of guys at you. But uh save your uh Laser, or your Sphere of a Dune Beam, or whatever you want to call it. Save it for those guys, because it'll make defending a lot easier, and you won't have to spend it and absorb it. Absorb it. Yeah, absorb it. That's a good word. Good word. Get out. Okay, slow down. <laughs> Learn to speak the English language, but uh, it saves you a lot of money, or a lot of minerals and gas down the uh, long run, instead of having to build static defenses all over the place. But I would say build them in Rainer and... Uh, Valerian's bases just to kind of help out a little bit just in case yeah they're starting to get overwhelmed that way your defenses can kind of hold the line for a bit but yeah I mean I did it within six disruptions one or two of which yeah because there was the one that they started sending the guys and then this last one which you know I was like yeah forget everybody I'm going in for the kill so yeah the first four try to get some good uh decent pacing done you know fight a little bit towards the thingy what's it I think I lost 15 yeah, I wasn't going to get the five thing. I imagine the majority of those died when I said, yeah, I'll let them handle the first wave. Uh, no, I won't. <laughs> no, I won't, because they didn't last nearly as long as I thought they would. But anyway, folks, I shall see you all in the next video.